God has provided a thread that runs clearly and brightly throughout all of Scripture. And in fact, it's a bright red thread. It is what we might call the scarlet thread. And it points to an important truth that we find in Hebrews chapter 9, verse 22, and quite simply, that without the shedding of blood, there is no forgiveness. No judge with integrity can wink at the guilt of another person who callously commits a crime. And the same is actually true of God. He sets the standard of what is just. So on the one hand, God never winks at our sin, but on the other hand, God's love also compels him to provide a way of redemption. Adam and Eve were tempted. They did eat. And they immediately began to have feelings for which there had been no precedent. Guilt. In Genesis 3.21, we read that the Lord God made garments of skin for Adam and his wife and clothed them. And where do you think God got those skins? He killed an innocent animal. The blood of an innocent must flow so that the guilty can live. Justice requires payment. In the course of that deliverance, God sends ten plagues, the last of which, the final one, we read, in, we read about in Exodus chapter 11, where God explains, I'm going to bring one more plague, and in it, uh, the firstborn of every household will die. And that night, the angel of death goes throughout Egypt, and every home suffers a death except for the households with lamb's blood on the doorframe. Justice requires payment. There will someday come an entirely innocent person, not an animal, like you are now, it's part of your system to have animal sacrifices and to shed their blood. Not an animal, but an entirely innocent person who will give his own blood as a sacrifice for human beings. He's the Messiah. And why would he do that? Because justice requires payment. But the innocent one, God the Son, stepped forward to die for you and for me. So Jesus invites you. He says, come, take this. Take my gift that I purchased with my own life's blood. Apply my death personally to your own life. So perhaps this morning, God's spirit is tugging at your heart, and there's a little voice that is saying, what this man is saying is true. If that's the case, then you take the next step. Justice requires payment. To tell us die. Paid in full. Jesus paid it all and it never needs to be paid again.